Well, our daughter Janelle is full of ambition and lots of energy and has lots of new ideas. So I have a GoPro 9 and I'm going to turn her loose and see what she can come up with some creative ideas on how to do some video. Well, these wheels get handled pretty rough when we're setting tires, so afterwards we need to go through kind of a cleanup process. There's some scorching, charring, and just some goo that needs to be scrubbed off. But also in the past few years as these wagons have dried out, we've gone around and tightened up nuts on these wagons. And sometimes, as you well know, I like to clock my nuts so that they're all square with the surface. So I'm going to turn Janelle loose and get her to straighten up all these nuts that are out of alignment on these wheels. Well, if you remember, I did reset a number of these hub bands before we set the tires, but I always want to double check them before I send them home, and there were actually three more that ended up needing to be tightened. One was real loose, the other were pretty marginal, but now's the time to deal with them. Well, it's kind of fun to have someone run the camera with a little different perspective. So we have a little different video as we're doing these hub bands and loading up the wheels back onto the horse trailer.
Well, it is good to have these wheels back on the wagons. They'll be pulled in the Bishop Mule Days Parade. If you ever get a chance to go see Bishop Mule Days, it's well worth the trip, especially if you like mules. You can also go see these wagons on display at the Laws Museum just a couple miles out of the town of Bishop. So once again, thanks for watching.